Turning now to campaign 2012, the candidates are all taking Christmas off, but the pollsters aren't. Whit Johnson has details. Hi, how are you? Today, Mitt Romney got a Christmas gift from New Hampshire. A new state poll has him leading by 22 points over rivals Newt Gingrich and Ron Paul. The poll also shows him favored by 32 percent of the state's independent voters. Oh, here we'll hit a... Although he trails Newt Gingrich nationally and in Iowa, Romney has historically polled better with independents. A recent study in USA Today shows that there are now 24 million registered independents. And a poll from earlier this year says their numbers have increased 8 percent over the last decade to 37 percent of American voters, the most of any time on record. Democrats and Republicans still have them beat with more than 70 million registered members combined, but their numbers have been slipping. And it's not just Republicans who need to appeal to voters outside their party. President Obama, whose 2008 victory was due largely to a surge of independence, knows he has to do more to win back their support. Jim Kessler is a senior vice president of Third Way, an independent think tank. They're going to be the deciders. They're going to be the ones that are going to pick the next president. They're very fickle voters. You don't know what they're going to do. As Americans grow more disgusted with dysfunction in Washington and are turned off by bitter party politics, candidates may want to start thinking purple instead of red or blue. Whit Johnson, CBS News, Washington.